perform rescue animation. Uh, thank you, Doctor. Uh, today I would like to perform a rescue uh, insertion for this gentleman. Okay. Uh, first of all, I would like to talk to the patient and uh, inform uh, verbal consent uh, regarding this procedure. Uh, sir, my name is Dr. Ikuan. I would like to perform uh, a tube insertion to your nostril, okay, to relieve your discomfort in the abdomen. Uh, I hope you agree for this uh, uh, procedure to be performed. Okay, thank you. Uh, next, I would like to prepare uh, my apparatus for this procedure, uh, which uh, includes uh, first is the rice tube itself, the syringe, uh, glove, lubricants. The drainage pad, uh, syringe uh, 10 cc for confirmation, uh, and also uh, a tape. Okay. Uh, first of all, I would like to take the rice tube and start my measurement from the tip, the nose, going to the ear loop, going back to the center, down until I reach the area just below the lymph sternum. Usually the measurement is around 40 cm. Okay. Next, I would like to wear a pair of gloves. I'm using size 12 or 14 rice tube. Next, I would like to duplicate this rice tube using a KYJ. Ask the patient which uh, nostril that patient feels uh, comfort for me to insert the rice tube. Uh, sir, may I know which uh, uh, nostril that you prefer for me to put uh, the tube? Uh, is it is, is there any bleeding or blocked nose happened to your nose recently? If there's none, I'm going to put on your uh, right nostril. Then. Okay. First of all, I just gently push the tube until okay. around 10 cm. Usually there is some resistance at the nasopharynx. Just pass it gently. Then I ask the patient to swallow. So let the bowl part close and the tube go nicely into the esophagus. When I reach around 35 to 40 cm, based on measurement before, I will stop inserting and confirm the placement by few methods. Any acetoscope? Flush 10 cc of air to hear a burping sound in the stomach by auscultation. Next one, I can aspirate its content to see whether it is gastric juice or bile. Then this gastric content can be sent to check on the litmus paper to show acidity. And also, I can use a daily pot with water and immerse this inside a, a, a water filled a gallery pot to look for air bubble means that uh, it is man position within the vacuum control tree. At the end, the confirmatory can be uh, uh, done by performing an abdominal x ray to look for the position of the rectal design. Before I end, I would like to wipe the nostril. and put a tape secure and connect this rice tube to the drainage pack. At the end, I'll thank the patient for this procedure. Sir, uh, thank you for allowing me to put this rice tube uh, to, to give you comfort from your uh, problem now. Okay, thank you. Okay, uh, this procedure has uh, some limitation. One is the contraindication for rice tube insertion usually happen when we suspect the patient has a face of skull fracture where the, the tube can malposition and going into the brain. Okay? Uh, then there are a few uh, small complications rarely happen but still can happen in a rice tube insertion. For example, uh, bleeding from the nostril itself uh, causing epistaxis. Uh, maybe there's some injury uh, around the esophagus because of laceration. Okay? Uh, and also malposition the tube set into the lung. Uh, however, there are actually uh, more important indications itself when we have to perform this procedure. For example, in the patient who has uh, 
intestinal obstruction for any possibility. For example, post-operative ideas. Uh, number two is uh, ob through obstruction secondary to a tumor or stricture or a valvulus. Uh, it is called a trip and sub strategy before the patient is embarked to the proper management plan. Uh, at the end, uh, the patient should go for a definite procedure to know the cause of the intestinal obstruction itself. Okay.